crazy, right? But anyway, let's talk about, let's go to Virginia. Let's go and put this up here on the screen to see if you all would be upset. They say, Democratic Virginia House candidate performed sex acts with her husband on webcam for tips. So they soliciting. She's showing that monkey. He's showing that meat. They getting it in, you know, for tips. Right, right, right. Do you know that people have a problem that she's running for office? People have a problem that she's running for office and she was performing sex acts with her own husband. Her husband, not not a stranger. Her husband is inside of their home, you know. Similar to like an OnlyFans. I'm not sure if they was on OnlyFans or was that chat, chat bait? I think it was chat bait. I don't think it's OnlyFans. It's that beautiful baby right here. Let's see what she said because I did not even watch what she said here. Um, Here we go. Hey, everyone. It is Susan. Susanna. Susanna. She's... She's being accused of performing sex acts with her husband in front of an online audience and encouraging viewers to send them tip money. Yeah, see, you're supposed to pay to watch people. Yeah, yeah. The 40-year-old mother. Oh, she don't even look 40. The 40-year-old mother of two is said to have posted more than a dozen videos on a platform called Chatterbait, Chatterbait in September 2022, which is after she officially entered the race. Also, it's after she officially entered the race that she was doing basically like her OnlyFans, and now y'all mad. I don't, I don't, I don't. told the Washington Post that the incident represents an illegal invasion of privacy designed to humiliate me and my family. Also, oh, somebody, watch this, watch this, watch this. This is an illegal invasion, right? That means someone in the community or somebody who recognized her was watching them on Chatterbait and tipping them. And they must have recognized her running for some type of um, running for Virginia House, and they outed her. That's what must have happened. So, is somebody who actually watches porn have a problem that she's doing porn and running for office? We play too much. Say, Willie, you know she looked 40 for real, for real. No, nah, she doesn't. I guess kind of like at certain angles or something. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Hello, hello. You say it won't intimidate me and it won't. And it won't silence me. Say my political opponents and their Republican allies have proven that they're willing to commit a sex crime to. Whoa, that they're willing to commit a sex crime to attack me and my family because there's no line they won't cross to silence women when they speak. Hold on, sugar. Yeah, yeah, damn it, you don't took it too far. My my political opponents and their Republican allies have proven they they're willing to commit a sex crime attack um to to attack me, commit a sex crime. I don't understand, baby. I don't understand. You was the only one who is said to be doing sex acts and asking for tips. I really don't understand. Mm-hmm. Let's scroll down just a little bit. She wants to represent District 57 in Richmond. Okay. She quite a bit more, um, sh- 
showed quite a bit more than skin on the adult streaming website Chatterbait, uh, according to the screenshots of archive material reviewed by the Post. Said so the 40-year-old nurse practitioner hosted more than a dozen of the live rumps. <laughs> romps with her husband on the platform, which was then posted to a a publicly a publicly accessible archive on the website re recu recubate recubate in September 2020 2022 after she declared her her candidacy. All this is trying to let us know. Listen, watch what. Before you run for office, yeah, yeah, she she was well, well, Cammy. All right, before you run for office, well, hell, I don't know why so many people believe that if they are doing, let's say, sexual, um, when you're doing your your porn, when you're doing your porn, I don't know why they believe that people would not screen record. I do not understand that at all. People are screen recording. People are using their cell phones to record your videos, to be able to post them somewhere later. It's a doggone shame. Gibson also apparently maintained her her chatterbait profile as having, having announced her campaign in July 2022, say uploading at least one picture of herself in a sex streaming site the following month. Oh. Say the unconventional candidate had more than 5,770 Chatterbait followers whom she reportedly pressed for more tokens in exchange for certain acts and private showings adding that she was raising money for a good cause. That's what's up. You say in other videos, she suggested that she and her husband have tried swap, um, swapping. Oh, they swapping with different partners as she is eth ethnically non-monogamous. Oh, shut up. But that he, but that he doesn't like sharing. Oh, oh, so she don't mind sharing. A husband mind sharing. <laughs> yeah, that baby a freak. Let the freak run for office. Ain't nothing wrong with it. She a super freak. Yeah. Yeah. Say she 40. Uh, well, I guess if you take off the makeup. Ooh, sugar. The hot wife experience. The hot wife experience. That damn it, we about to look it up, huh? <laughs> Gibson also thanked um her often thanked her viewers after the tokens arrived and her husband, a lawyer, in at least one case echoed her request. Hold on, hold on. Um Chatterbait terms and conditions states. Requesting or demanding specific acts for tips may result in a ban from the platform for all parties involved. Look at that nice young couple. That baby slanging that monkey. That baby want to share. She want to switch up. Hit a little swap. She living her best life. She living her best life. You say in a statement to the Washington Post, Gibson called the publicly post videos an illegal invasion on my privacy designed to humiliate me and my family. You say, I won't um, be, damn it, it won't intimidate me and it won't silence me. We read that there earlier. Look at that beautiful um, family. Oh, I gotta get me a blazer like this right here. I gotta get me old blazer. Show enough do. Show enough do. Look at her. her son don't even know that she a freak right now. Or oh, shh, I don't. I don't know what goes on behind closed doors, but I am under the assumption that her son don't know, and maybe her daughter might have like a little feeling, but when her daughter get older, her daughter be like, well, shit. Mama was slinging that monkey and got married. Mama was getting that thing away, swapping with dad. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. And they seemed happy. He don't like the swap. 
but he's not going to stop her from swapping. He's not going to stop her from having her ex extracurricular activities. Of course not, because then he's going to lose his wife and she's going to take half. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because she can file and say, well, I am divorcing him because he is oppressing me and you cannot oppress a woman in 2023. <laughs> yeah. He say her campaign did not immediately respond to a request for a comment. Gibson is going up against the Republican David Owens, a former home builder for November 7th election as Democrats are seeking to regain the majority in the 100 member Virginia House. OK, Republicans currently control the lower chamber by three delegates for 49 to 46 delegates lead the state, the Senate, by 22 to 18. Yeah, she gonna be just like her mama. <laughs> Baby gonna be just like her dog on mama. And in the street, slang, slang that monkey. You can still um be like, well respected. Don't worry about that. Don't let nobody fool y'all. Um, Gibson launched her own campaign in July 2022 and has since raised 376 and eight $376,895 during her campaign compared with $339,621 um, 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 raised by Owen campaign, according to the campaign finance website that Virginia Public Access Pro Project. You say, however, she maintains just $77,435 cash on hand after going head, head to head in June. 20 of the Democratic primary with opponent Bob Shipped, I guess that's how you pronounce it. Owens have retained 166,000 of his funds after facing no primary challenges. So he he lost over a hundred thousand dollars and did not face anybody in the primary. She faced it somebody in the primary and she done lost over two hundred close to two hundred thousand i really don't see why campaigns and stuff cost this much money especially with social media i really do not understand when they are campaigning for their own district this is like a district campaign so why do we need so much money when we have social media you can target people in zip code Digital marketing? No, no, okay. You can target them like with Facebook ads and with Instagram ads and it won't cost you 200000 if I'm not mistaken. No. I'm just thinking it through. But notice, she raised three seventy six, and she been showing her whole body. The man raised three thirty nine and have not shown anything as far as we know. So she been getting it in, doing what she liked to do, and raised 376. Maybe the people watching really didn't like what y'all was doing. <laughs> I don't know. Mm -hmm. I don't know, but it looked like such a cute couple. Keep up the good work. We really not tripping. Um, that, Damn it. I think I done been on this one just a tad bit too long to where I forgot that I had the damn video. Hold on. I just felt like talking because I felt like being here. But here we go. Controversy is brewing around a Virginia House of Delegates candidate. Pornographic videos of Democrat Susanna Gibson have... We say pornographic videos as if that's a problem. I'm so sick of us adults acting like porn is the problem when the, the majority of adults watch and do porn. If you're having sex, you're doing porn. Can we just make it like that, that simple? Porn is sex. Sex is porn. Simple. Surfaced. She is running for Virginia's 57th district. Capitol Bureau reporter Tyler Englander has more on the story drawing national attention. According to the Washington Post, Democratic delegate candidate Susanna Gibson performed sex acts with her husband in online videos and asked viewers for tips to perform certain acts. You see how you see it? and ask viewer for tips. That's what goes on when you live cam and sex acts. In case you all don't know, like she's not the first to ask for tips when you own these, that because it's live. 
it's live and this is what you're supposed to do. People are supposed to give you tokens and do all of this fly stuff. Don't ask me how I know, but if you just go on it, you'll see it for your damn self. The Washington Post says a Republican operative alerted them to videos in which Gibson and her husband stream sex acts on a website called Chatterbait. Oh, so the opponent. <laughs> well, hell, we did read it, but they didn't say that her opponent notified people. Certain acts. Say that again. The Washington Post says a Republican operative alerted them to videos in which Gibson and her <laughs> husband stream sex acts on a website called Chatterbait. He hating. He hating. Come on, my Republican buddy. You hating out here at all. More than a Come dozen on. videos were archived on other websites. In a statement, Gibson nice. responded by saying in part, this is an illegal invasion of my privacy designed to humiliate me and my family. It won't intimidate me and it won't silence me. No, it won't. My political right. opponents and their Republican allies have proven they're willing to commit a sex crime to attack me and my family because there's no line they won't cross to silence women when they speak up. Political oh, analyst oh, Rich Marr reacted to the controversy. Where we normally think of like, well, sex tape, that's bad. Something bad has happened. But I actually do think that a lot of Democrats particularly are, are thinking more about this was consensual sex. This was with her husband. Gibson is in a tight battle with Republican David Owen to represent District 57 in the Virginia House of Delegates. The district narrowly voted for Governor Glenn Youngkin in 2021, but favored Democrats in congressional races in 2022. Marr says due to extreme political polarization, Gibson's latest controversy is unlikely to have a big impact on the race. If this is some something that would offend you as a voter, you probably weren't going to vote for her anyway. Facts. Facts. And if this is something that doesn't bother you quite so much, you were probably going to vote for her in the, in the first place. So I don't think it changes the dynamic of voting for most of the people in the district. Governor Glenn Youngkin reacted to the news, saying he's focused on electing Republican candidates. I think that's a topic that she and the Democratic Party are going to have to deal with. Gibson's opponent, David okay. Owen, said in a statement, I'm sure this is a difficult time for Susanna and her family, and I'm remaining focused on my campaign. In Richmond, I'm Tyler Englander. Shout that baby out. Right, listen, if you want to do like your own research, if you want to do your own research for Susanna, Susanna, yeah, Susanna Gibson, Um, you can just Google it, yeah, yeah, you can Google it, yeah, not bad, not bad, not bad at all. Not bad at all. I think like she liked to swim and stuff. She got the like the bikini lines and all that stuff right there. Okay. You got to look at that right there on your own. You say Hunter Biden <laughs> Hunter Biden do it in do in hard and soft. It, yeah. Hunter Biden doing hard and soft. He said, who left the cocaine on the table? That's a doggone shame out here. But Susan, Susanna Gibson, when you type Susanna Gibson in, baby. Yep, we got them. Oh, somebody leaked that for real, for real. We got them. <laughs> That's about all I can tell you. She just, like, it's just they doing regular stuff. You know, she doing oral, and then he do oral. I don't know. This ain't, come on now. I thought that we was adults. We supposed to be adults. Now, now we feel some type of way. We cannot vote in somebody who have sex. That's basically what it is. <laughs> Now, listen, a lot of people may say, well, damn, they didn't need them. Oh, shit, this a whole, oh, this a whole archive. Wait a minute. We're at shake, shakevid.com, um, shakevid, triple X. 